Hey, what's up everyone? Glock9 here and welcome back to Ark. It is the morning of day three. I got the bottom half of the base upgraded to stone last night and we got a little visitor last night. Another Dilo wandered into camp, so I tamed him up. We got our Ed, Ed and Eddie now and check out Eddie. Dude, level 198. Pretty crazy stats on this guy. So we got our beginnings of a little Dilo army. I'm pretty happy with all the tames we got right now, especially the three Stegos. They're all high level. We got Lisa, Maggie, and Homer. Maggie actually had a mutation. So she's uh, two levels higher than the others. She also got this glowing green skin, which is crazy. And the plates on her back have this pattern on them. You can see it better when the sun's shining directly on her, but pretty sweet. So I got the saddle on Maggie right now. And they're all tough as shit, too. We got attacked by an Alpha Raptor last night. And usually, I keep the cameras running in case some crazy shit like that happens. Of course, I didn't. But it doesn't matter, because nobody got killed. The three Stegos destroyed the Raptor. That's how I got my hands on this Journeyman crossbow and uh, this Journeyman axe. I also got a Raptor claw, which I put in storage. Let's uh, close these doors, actually, because this morning, we are taking this raft that I crafted over to Herbivore Island. It's that island in the distance there you can just... Just barely make out and there should be a bunch of metal there and that is what I'm after today and it's not just a clever name either herbivore islands full of herbivores so no real threats I hope we can find some Ankies though because I plan on taming one that will make mining the metal a lot easier and before we go any further though let me first apologize for my voice I'm on the back end of a head cold so my apologies there I didn't want to put off recording this another day though it's itching to get back in and secondly, we're going to protect our raft using these nine stone foundations. We're going to put the first one in right about here, lower it all the way down. And then you can just go bam, bam, fill the raft up with your foundations. But then the problem is you can't drive the raft. You need to be able to access some part of the raft in order to be able to drive it. And no, the mast does not count. So we're going to pick this one up and this one. And this one, and we got to pick up this one too. We, we got to float a foundation on the back end here. And we can't have it snapping to any one of these other foundations. So, come on, float you piece of shit. It's usually a little easier than this. Maybe I got to pick this one up. Come on. All right, uh, let's try this again. There we go. Okay, so we want to float it, I guess, right about there. Lower it all the way down. All right, and then put this one in like that. And then that, that, and that. And doing that left a little crack right here, and that will allow me to access the raft and be able to drive it. And it's still completely protected. I mean, as protected as the stone will allow it to be. If we get attacked by something big and crazy, it can still destroy the stone, but it'll take a lot longer than just the regular old raft. Plus, now we can put some storage down, which I brought with me. We'll put that in once we get to Herbivore Island. Hold up. Gotta get a little bit of chitin right here. I would like to make some chitin armor. I've been on the lookout for trilobites. Haven't seen one yet. Get the fuck out of here, duck. <laughs> what, are you, what the fuck is this guy doing? <laughs> what are you, stupid, huh? You little duck brain thought it was a good idea to attack me? <laughs> Get the fuck out of here, ant. All right, some chitin. Uh, let's continue on our journey here. This looks like a fine place to park. Like I said, we don't got to worry about any of the dinosaurs on this island, unless, of course, we attack them first, which is probably going to happen at some point. I'm going to put my storage in. Just like this. I made six little ones. And that's, of course, uh, so when we mine a bunch of metal and stone, we can just fill up the storage boxes and we don't got to worry about getting encumbered. Oh, what do you want to borrow the raft, buddy? Go ahead. Be my guest. Just bring it back when you're done. All right. First thing we want to do is try and find an Ankylosaurus that we can tame. Because that'll make it, like I said, quicker and easier to mine a bunch of metal and stone. I think they mine stone just as efficiently as metal. Maybe not as efficiently as those those little bowling ball looking dinosaurs. What the hell are they called again? I forget. Anyway, if I find one of those here, I'll tame that too. What a pain in the ass this tall grass is. 
I can't see shit. Oh, here's some metal. Metal nodes uh, look a little different now. Here we go. I like the color. Level 35. I mean, it'll be easy to knock out, that's for sure, but I'm gonna keep looking. Well, there are not many on this island. Let's see what we got here. Level 10. That sucks. Those are the only two I've seen. I've been over, like, the whole island. Oh, wait, there's one over there. On that little island. Well, if it's not any better than level 35, we'll just go tame the original one we found. How you looking, my friend? Level 70. Well, you're the winner. What'd you win? Well, that's going to be hard to explain. Let me just uh, show you what you won. It's, it's this right here. Congratulations. Oh, shit. Man, she could... Ow! <laughs> she could swim pretty fast for having those little legs. With her shape, I thought she would have sunk like a stone. At least we got her on the main island now. And that's it. They're pretty easy. No need for a trap. Of course, I forgot the berries that I set aside to bring. That's all right, we'll just pick some more. But yeah, I, even the level 70 didn't require that many arrows to put down, so... Easy peasy. We'll get her tamed up. And, uh, oh shit, you know what else I forgot? To make a saddle, we're gonna have to stop back home. All right, that's good enough for now. Check this out, though. Found an explorer note over here. I am not going to grab it yet. I'm going to wait until the Anki is tamed, and I'll grab it with the Anki. So we both get levels. Okay, we've got 255 hide. I think that's short. Yeah, we need 260. <laughs> well, you know what that means. Someone on this beach has to die. You're the lucky winner, bitch. Oh, I'll tell you what you don't want to be in this series. A winner. <laughs> you get killed or shot in the face with an arrow. Patty's happy about it. Okay, the hide, wood, and metal. I got more metal in the forge. Oh, I need fiber, not wood. That'll do it. Here we are, and the Anki is awake, patiently awaiting our return. What's up, girl? Level 104, pretty sweet. Here is your saddle, and here's some more berries to eat. Okay, let's give you a name now. Your name is going to be April O'Neil. Okay, ready to get some metal, April? Of course you are. You're ready to do whatever I tell you to do, because I'm the one who feeds you berries. Well, I'm going to mine this metal now, lady. You don't want to move? Fine. If you get hit, though, it's your own fault. I warned you. And now you want to fight me? I'm telling you, that's a bad idea. I would just walk away now. All right, then. <laughs> She's gonna push me off the cliff. Unbelievable. You fucking bitch. Oh, that didn't hurt at all. April's got those those thick legs. She is encumbered, though, so we're gonna have to unload some shit out of her. There's another level. We're just gonna pump weight. Because she's gonna be our little workhorse. Oh, shit. I didn't even see that there. Is this lady really going to talk? Can I shut her up? It's always some lady with an accent, too, so she sounds all smart. He's the largest dinosaur on the island. 
And he's a cave dweller. They should just get someone from Brooklyn to do it. They'll keep it nice and short and sweet. And let me tell you about this dinosaur, okay? First of all, he's fucking big. He lives in caves and shit. He'll climb up the walls. Forget about it. And that's it. It's done. That's all you need to know. Let's go wait again, and let's unload this shit, and then we're gonna go get that other explorer note before we uh, get out of here. Excuse me, with your big ass feet. Possessing the appearance oh, of god, a here we go again. Dinosaur, in the rivers Ten levels, island. holy shit! It would be about I ain't even mad. Talk all you want, lady. No one's listening, no us. bitch. <laughs> Can't force me to learn. Well, she doesn't really get a ton of stone. I thought we'd grab a bunch before we leave, because why not? But yeah, she's real. I mean, she's getting more flint than stone, which is good. We need flint, too. But we gotta get those, uh... That those other... That, we gotta get that other dino. The Diplo? What is, it, what is it called? You guys know what I'm talking about. That's really the one meant for mining stone. Hey, look at, uh... This poor Simon over here stuck in the rocks. You need some help, buddy? Huh? Oh, sorry. Ooh, level 150. We should get this little fucker. April! No! Stop it! Stop! God, I appreciate you having my back and shit, but I got things under control. Here we go. And for the Fio, I'm gonna step away from the cartoon character names and name it Simon. Of course, after the Simon from Neebs Gaming, that's what I named my Fios. All of them, I named them all Simon in the original Island series. And I'm gonna do the same thing here, cause it's funny. Besides, Simon is uh, basically a cartoon character anyway, so it works. Get out of my way, fuckers! What are you, stuck? You still stuck in these rocks, huh? Well, let's see if I can break you free here. All right, you good? You good now? Yeah, you're good. All right, let's go home. Uh, there's another T-Rex down the beach. Not far from here. You can see it. Uh, so let's get this shit unloaded, and let's get a trap built on the beach just in case that thing makes its way down here. Gotta split this stack of metal in half. I can't carry a full stack. Let's get it smelting down. We should craft a second forge. You know, I was going to seal this corner off, but I kind of like it, because you can use it as like a bit of a shortcut, just jumping up on those steps like that. Alright, that's everything. Now, like I said, we should build a trap on the beach. I heard dinosaurs don't go up ramp traps anymore like they used to. I don't know, though. I kind of want to build one anyway. See for myself. Alright, so super basic trap. We're just gonna do a 2x2 two two foundation, and then we're gonna put up the walls too high. Uh, let's use the double door block. That, that should work better. The T-Rex definitely can't get through a double door. There we go, now we just put the ramp in, and we're done. Like I said, pretty damn basic. I've used this trap countless times to capture all different types of dinosaurs. I know it works on a T-Rex, or at least it used to. Uh, from what I heard, though, the dinos just go around the ramp. They refuse to go up the ramp now. But we're going to find out. Um, should I? The T-Rex the should be able to walk up that with that little gap there. That shouldn't make a difference. Alright, it'd be nice if I had a spyglass, so I knew what I was walking into right now, but I don't. We'll have to find some crystal and make one. For now, I'm just gonna shoot this motherfucker and see what happens. I kinda hope it's a low level, just in case the trap doesn't work. Alright, it is on like Donkey Kong, as they say. And he's tracking me nicely.
I hope that lip doesn't bother him. Let's go, baby. Oh, you son of a bitch. He did go around it. Oh, not good. Not good. Is it the lip? Oh, I should have brought that ramp all the way down to the ground. Then I wouldn't be questioning it right now, whether that's the problem or not. Hey, where you going? This is nowhere near over. Come on. Hey, 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 you don't even think about fucking with them. Oh shit, it's going down. What was it, like a level 10? Almost landed on Dora. It is a level 10. <laughs> Damn it. I mean, actually good. That is good. Because the trap didn't fucking work. Dora, you should not be here. Alright, so. What I'm gonna do now is take down one side of the wall here. And then I'm gonna get a large bear trap crafted and put it in the middle of the foundations. And then we can lure a dinosaur in into the bear trap and then throw up the wall real quick trapping it inside and the bear trap will trap any dinosaur because i've trapped a giga with it in the past so it'll grab a hold of any dinosaur but not for long what are you doing get out of here bitch here we go now i forget how how do we arm this thing? Does it arm itself? Yep, there it goes. Okay. You know what I just realized? Patty Mayo is gone. Uh, uh, uh. I don't see her. Did she get killed? I mean, she always runs away. <laughs> Whenever some shit jumps off, Patty's fucking gone. That's why I usually throw her inside the base. But she's not on the list of dinos that I can track. So I think she's dead. And there's a car now. Did that fucking thing kill her? But how would it just kill Patty and not start a huge fight? I don't know, but we're going to test out this new trap. Oh, my God. Now we got to make a big sweeping turn here. To get it out to go inside. Oh, fucking Dora. What are you doing? Run away. Flee. Get out of here. All right. Let's go. Get in here. Get. Oh, so close. Oh, shit. It can go through the fucking double doors, the car. No. Well, I'm a fucking idiot. I hope you're a low level. It does seem hurt. Oh, and see, the bear trap does not hold him for long, but it's running away. That's good. At least it's not going to kill us. I would like to tame it, though. Oh, my God. Holy shit. Oh. What are you, level 20? No, 65. Hey, that's not bad. Not bad at all. All right, come here, Lisa. I gotta figure out how to, like, make it so the dinosaurs go back to where they were after a fight breaks out. Oh, here we go. Uh, the Rex is gonna be Bobby Hill. Since he's just a level 10. Well, he should be higher than a level 10 now. 14. <laughs> Whatever. Come on, Lisa, I want you over on this side of the base. Holy shit! Another one of these fucking chickens? He's gonna kill Bobby Hill. There goes fucking Simon running away. Oh, what a mess. No, oh, Bobby. Shit. Um, the saddle is on Maggie. What the hell is going on? You done? You just gonna stand there? Oh, well, here. Take a couple of these. Yeah, you son of a bitch. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Ow. Someone kill it. Here, April. We'll do it. There's Maggie. Oof, we're fine. April O'Neil will handle the job. Oh, yeah, and April did get the kill. Look at that. Huh. <sighs> Put that into wait. Why not? Well, that was a fucking mess. 
I kept my eye on the top of the screen, though, to make sure none of my dinos died. And none did, except for Bobby Hill, of course. What are you gonna do? I'll tell you what we're gonna do. Get a bunch of hide. That's what we're gonna do. Here, take the prime meat instead. Alright, we got the Carno, at least. And her name is gonna be Tina Belcher. For no specific reason, just because Tina Belcher is an amazing character. What's up, Tina? Uh... I don't know where Dora is. I mean, I did tell her to flee. So, <laughs> I don't know how far away she went. Ah, uh, whatever. I'll see if I can find her on the map. Uh, I want to go get this drop, though, real quick. Let's take uh, April O'Neil into the water because there's a shit ton of piranhas in there. And here we go. Fuck you, piranhas. Yeah, you shit. Uh, just grab everything. April! Come here! Okay. We did it. Well, one of the things I spotted was the sickle that we grabbed out of there. That's nice. We can get a bunch of plant fiber with that, but not berries, unfortunately. A cannon? Holy shit, can we put that on top of the base for protection? And a tripwire alarm. And some soap. Good, because we're a fucking mess. Um, yeah, for harvesting berries, we're going to have to go get another moss chops. Even though I think... I think Stegos can harvest a good amount of berries, too. Man, it's getting crazy. I need to get my arms around this thing. I need to maybe build some walls. Put up some defenses. Protect our dinosaurs a bit more. I'm, I still think we're in a good position. I mean, today was a great day. We, we got an Anki. We got a Simon. Both high level. We got a Carno. Decent level. We only lost... Well, <laughs> I mean, we lost Patty Mayo. I don't know where Dora is. Bobby Hill came and went. <laughs> you know, he was only a level 14 anyway, so who cares? But overall, I think it was a pretty good day. I need to spend the rest of the day grinding for stone so we can build a wall. Keep these dinos protected and together. And, uh, what now? What's happening? Oh, just the Dilo that Tina is murdering. No big deal. But then everyone everyone goes crazy and shit, you know? I, I, like I said, I need to get my arms around this fucking base. And when I say arms, I mean a wall <laughs> around this shit. So I'm going to do some grinding for stone and start working on that. And uh, I need to completely rethink traps as well. Even though I think the trap with the bear trap is, is not a bad idea. I just need to use, um, probably behemoth gates instead with the gate that I can open and close. Um, so yeah, traps is another thing I need to, uh, really put some thought into. So we can get a, a good working trap here on the beach because T Rexes keep coming and I want to get one of them. So. Uh, I'm gonna put some thought into that and get some work done here, some grindy work, and we'll pick things up here on the morning of day four. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I hope you're looking forward to seeing more. Thank you so much for watching and all the support. You guys are the best. You can follow me on Instagram or Twitter if you want. It's at Glock9Gamer. I follow all gamers back. Stick around for more ARK, and I will catch you guys in the next episode.